Understanding why as a relative adverb, making sense of reasons. Hello there, English learners. Welcome back to our series on Intermediate English Grammar. Today, we're going to delve into an exciting aspect of relative clauses, the use of why as a relative adverb. We're specifically going to look at identifying why as a relative adverb in sentences. So, let's get started. Before we dive into the usage of why, let's quickly refresh our understanding of relative adverbs. These are words that introduce relative clauses, and they usually relate to a place, time, or reason. The three most common ones are where, when, and why. Today, our focus is on why, which is used to indicate reasons. Now, how do we identify why as a relative adverb in sentences? It's simple. Look for sentences where why is used to connect two clauses, and it refers to a reason or cause. For instance, consider the sentence, do you know why he's upset? Here, why is the relative adverb connecting the main clause, do you know, with the relative clause, he's upset, providing a reason. It's always good to reinforce learning with practice. So, let's look at a few sentences and identify why as a relative adverb. 1. I never understood why she was so angry. 2. Can you explain why the project was delayed? 3. This is the reason why I never tried skiing. In each of these sentences, why acts as a relative adverb linking the main clause with a relative clause that provides a reason. Now it's your turn to apply what you've learned. Here are a few sentences. Try identifying why as a relative adverb. 1. Did you ever wonder why birds can fly? 2. That's the reason why we need to leave early. 3. Please tell me why you're unhappy. Well, that's all for today's lesson on identifying why as a relative adverb in sentences. Remember, practice makes perfect, so don't forget to apply what you've learned today in your daily conversations. Hope you found this video helpful, and happy learning!